Hello, I'm at the launch of Adria's 2018 UK caravan range where the hot news is the reintroduction of this little fella. After five years absence we got the action back. So let's go and have a look at the action and then I'll take you around some of the other new models for 2018. So here we go. Many years ago, I had an earlier incarnation of the action as a test caravan. And in those days, you didn't have all these windows at the front and it felt a little bit claustrophobic at the front. Whereas now, if I sit down, you've got this little peekaboo window. You can now have a good old nosy at what's going on on the site. Who's out there? In common with all Adria caravans, it's got a great smart finish. I do like this minimalist style. I really do. Obviously that's a matter of personal taste. It just fits with mine. Now the one thing you don't have with the Action is hanging space, which is very modern. You do get a decent heater and that's got a mains element as well. I can see that's an ultra heat. So that's gas and mains. And your fridge is at waist level. And then your wardrobe, which is shelved, which actually makes far better use of space, is closer to the ground, which when you think about it, that actually makes more sense. You've got quite a few of these shell um, drawers. Combi grill oven, sink, two burner hob, a little cupboard here. Well, I say little, it's actually quite deep. Now, you got some USB points there. The kitchen socket is up there, which means your kettle lead is going to be dangling down to the work surface. Hmm. Oh, goodness me. Nice deep drawers and finally the washroom. And again, the huge improvement here over the previous incarnation of the action is the fact that now the sink is a fold down unit. It's not taking up space when you're not using it. Electric flush cassette toilet and not just a shower, but a decent towel rail as well. The entry level Altea range is largely unchanged for 2018. And I'm going to bring you into the 7 just to show you a family layout. So the Altea range has a new feel to the interior. It is largely unchanged, however I brought you into the 7, which is a family friendly layout, because this one for 2018 will have the option of a triple bunk where well, here there is a double bunk. So in the Altea 7, you will be able to specify either a double bunk as this one, or you'll be able to have a triple bunk. Quick look around the rest of the caravan. Adria's brilliantly designed kitchen, which I absolutely love, because in front of the hall, you have this work surface come serving up area. 
This particular one, I can't say I'm a fan of the main socket there, but it's always hard to get the kitchen sockets in the right place. A nice fridge with a freezer box. Truma heating with blown air and that works off mains and gas. Combi grill and oven. And then finally into the bathroom, which is a wet room style bathroom and certainly no worse for it. So you have your shower, you have a towel rail there, you have a second hanging rail there which is just brilliant so if you want to use this for clothes storage or for drying off your towel after a shower and then fantastic idea space saving sink which is only going to take up space when you're using it above the toilet oh and decent sized wardrobe as well Oh, that's very sexy. Soft clothes runners there. I wonder if that extends to the uh, chest of drawers at the back. Yes, it does. An entry level caravan with soft closed door runners. What about the roof lockers? They don't close themselves, but. Don't slam either. Now onto the Adora range and all Adoras for 2018 are going to have these very smart silver sides and to go in. And now all Adora caravans are going to be having Alda central heating every single one. So I've brought you into the Thames and there's a very good reason I've brought you into the Thames and that is because it's now ending up as one of the very few luxury caravans with a French bed because most caravans now are going crazy for the transverse or the island bed but if you don't mind a French bed and you can see you can adjust them to sit up as well. And the Thames has a huge wardrobe. Look at that. Enormous. And of course the great thing is this is over the axle. So it's going to be really great for towing stability with all your ball gowns and heavy coats in there. And then this side of the wardrobe is all shelved. The kitchen is your typical, very well planned, very well designed Adria kitchen with separate grill and oven. Just love the workspace that's offered in front of the, the hob. Three burners on the hob. And again, they're just it's just so easy to use. Tall fridge freezer. Huge ice box. More storage because there just isn't enough clothes storage. My goodness, look at all this. Storage everywhere. Finally into the washroom. Where you have your loo. Boutique style basin. And there is your shower compartment with a decent towel rail. However, I'm not too keen on the wallboard lining, I have to say. I would much rather see a sealed shower cubicle. But nevertheless, for occasional use, that's absolutely fine. And with the rail in there, again, you've got the option of even more clothes storage.
so the Alpina is largely unchanged for 2018. Nice, spacious lounge. Gorgeous curved cupboards. Just give you a close up there of the upholstery scheme. And then these cupboards. Just very gentle little catches there. New for this year is Alda underfloor heating. In addition to the regular Alda central heating. And then the Missouri, which is this model has had the position of the bed changed. So now the Missouri has a transverse bed. And because the caravan is eight foot wide, you don't have to worry about pulling the bed out at night. So yes, very, very swish. Back to the main body of the caravan tall set for the fridge, fairly substantial freezer box, nice big salad drawer, and in common with many Adria caravans is really neat kitchen layout which gives you all this work surface in front of the cooker as well as to the side. Very well placed sockets there and separate grill and oven. Finally, over to the washroom on the other side of the caravan. And you can see, I love these, these space saving fold down sinks. Very smart cupboards. And then on the other side, you have this shower cubicle, complete with a radiator. And again, really neat touch, which is a rail to dry out your towel afterwards. Very smart. So there you have it, that is Adria's 2018 caravan range, all different models in those ranges I've just featured. As ever, this is not an in-depth review. This is just a quick first look to give you a feel of Adria's new ranges. Don't forget to check out my video about Adria's 2018 motor caravan range. In the meantime, if you like this, you know what to do. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you don't already, and it just needs to say, Thanks for tuning in.